The last of the leaves are hanging on, but mostly they're starting to fall. And that's changing everything. The light is completely different now, and I'm appreciating any little tree that is still giving me some color. As I shared in my video last week, I have been making sure that I take a walk every single day, and that is making such a difference for me. I love walking anywhere, I'll walk anywhere, but I especially love walking in the woods, and especially in this little area that is just very near and dear to me. And while I used to listen to music when I would walk, I have not been doing that now. I have just been allowing nature to be my music, and it allows me to really tune in deeply with my surroundings. I often find myself this time of year feeling a little bit annoyed at the wind because it swoops through and then there go the leaves. In fact, often you go to bed and there's leaves on the trees, there's one good storm, and you wake up to bare trees. And we're getting there, we're almost at that point where the trees will be bare. But I've been noticing as I've been taking my walks something that, I don't know, maybe I've never really meditated on it before. but. Nature is such a pro at changing. Even when she's changing, she does it so gracefully, which is not something I've ever been that great at. I'm not good at change, but nature's teaching me here. I came out here looking for pine cones today. I was gonna go to a different spot, but wow! <laughs> so many pine cones. I still haven't gotten the chance to respond to all your beautiful comments from last week's video. I appreciate every single one of them and as they've popped in, I've read them all so full of amazing suggestions. It's like a little resource page that I can come back to and you all can too because you all shared so many beautiful ideas. Now one thing that a lot of people reminded me of was how important it is to do some grounding. And this was a really warm day, so I kicked off my shoes and enjoyed the soft pine needles beneath my feet, which felt absolutely amazing. brought all the pine cones back to the cottage thinking that I would do some crafts with them but actually I think I'm going to just store them in a nice dry area and use them as fire starters for the bonfire pit. <laughs> oh boy that's gonna take a little bit of time to get my sappy feet <laughs> cleaned up. Totally worth it.
I feel like when the leaves are fluttering, <laughs> I feel like they're cheering me on. You know how when people who do sign language clap, they clap like this. And that's what I feel like the leaves look like. <laughs> like they're saying, good job, keep going. <laughs> Maybe I'm weird or I don't know, but that's just what I've been thinking as I've been looking at them. They're cheering for me. I'm at the most beautiful spot. This was one of my favorite spots when I lived on this side of the Hudson River. And it's gorgeous. <laughs> I mean, look at this. But it's not even the best part. The best part is in the woods, not even a very far walk, just a little bit of a walk, 10 minute walk. But I just photographed a couple here and um, I'm about an hour and 20 minutes away from home. But I could not leave without <laughs> coming back and getting some footage of just how beautiful it is because, oh my goodness. And this is my walk for the day. I am feeling so much better. I'm still, it's gonna take time. It's gonna take time, but the walks and being in nature, it's huge. It's huge. So for the moment, that's my priority. It's just healing in nature. And I mean, sheesh, how can you not heal here? It's so beautiful. It has been unseasonably warm here in the Hudson Valley. Today, it was actually almost 80 degrees. In fact, it might have been 80 degrees, but I can't say that it bothered me too much because it felt so good to have my skin out there in the air, feeling the breeze. The temperature is gonna drop dramatically tonight. So we had lots and lots of breeze out there today, knocking off the last few leaves that are still hanging on for dear life but it felt really nice to be out there and watching the leaves flutter as they're clapping for me and just really soaking in every scent because when the sun is out and it's warm oh those pine needles smell incredible this video is not sponsored by headspace but i did download the app and i have been really enjoying the meditations especially when i'm sitting out here in nature it's just very calming and just as the ocean waves pulse, your heart beats. 
I've been taking a lesson from the leaves. They have no say in the matter, they have to fall. And yet when they do, they do it with such beauty and grace and elegance. I personally have a lot of changes that need to be made in life right now. And that is not easy. Change has always scared me. But I want to try and float through all the changes with beauty and grace, just like these leaves. 